pleased to be both really pleased with the master teachers, but also with you, because you're going to get this, and you're going to be able to get this and transmit it to your kids, and they're going to get this message that they can make a difference in the world, and they can have fun doing it, and they can learn something. I'm sure. Thank you very much. So, I'm blessed to be here. Let's talk about Houses for Change, which is the Sadaka Arts and Crafts project that I literally dreamed up at 4 o'clock in the morning after my first experience helping homeless families with kids in a program much like you've talked about here. I was so moved that my subconscious combined the idea of a Sadaka box that would look like a house, that kids would decorate to look like a house, take it home, a little change, and give the money to any homeless shelter that they chose. It would be entirely up to them. And also, if I use the word Sadaka box, it would be universal. You do it in a church setting, you might call it an admin box or or a collection box. You do it in a, in, a, in a public school or a Boy Scout troop. You might call it a, a piggyback or a collection box. Didn't matter what you call it. By me, it's a Sadaka box. 